It may not be apparent to the average user in 3D Coach that you have symmetry snapping available in the Retopo workspace. So I want to go ahead and show how that works. When you are working with creation tools, there is no snapping feature, although that may be coming in the near future. But when you are manipulating vertices, there is symmetry snapping. So I'm going to hit the S key to bring up the symmetry panel and enable it and choose which axis I want to utilize. And then you'll notice that many of these vertices are not yet aligned to the symmetry plane. With move weld, you're moving individual vertices or edges, or in this case, maybe edge loop. But let's go to vertices and I'm going to just try and align them roughly. And 3D Co actually will snap these within a certain threshold. I'm going to bring that up to 50 or so. You'll notice how if I try to drag left and right, it will not let me because it's snapping to that symmetry plane. Okay, doing the same thing here, all of these. I can go up and down, but not left or right across the symmetry line. Let's use a creation tool. For demonstration purposes, I'll leave it off the symmetry plane just a bit. Now right click to create the polygons. All right, and I can right click over a point and move it to manipulate it if I need. Okay, so I'll continue creating a few more. All right. Once this is welded, you'll notice as I drag right and left, it continues to stay snapped to that symmetry plane. I'll speed it up a little bit while I continue, but that should conclude this look at using the symmetry plane snapping in 3D Coats Retopology Workspace. Thank you for watching, and we will see you next time.